I'm Ty Paddington. It's the first week of December 2006, and this is Showbiz Newsy News. Tom Cruise and Katie Holmes tied the knot in Italy, and the photos are everywhere. Showbiz Newsy News has exclusive photos ourselves. Let's take a look. Ah, oh, that is so cute. Good luck, space kids. But with every new marriage, there's a divorce. Kid Rock and Pamela Anderson are getting divorced after only three months of marriage. Shocker. Aww. Oh, I know. It's horrible, isn't it? Pam will keep her wedding ring, and Kid Rock will keep his hepatitis C. Good for him. Of course, those two stories pale in comparison to Britney Spears this week. It seems the newly divorced Brit is hanging out with the brain trust that is Lindsay Lohan and Paris Hilton. The Three Stooges are partying till 5 a.m. with no panties. Here's Brittany getting into Paris' car. Whoa! <coughs> I think I just threw up a little in my mouth. I think we've seen enough of that. Oh, come on! I just had a taco salad. I'll never be able to eat roast beef again. Michael Richards got busted using the N-word on stage at a comedy club last week. The comedian was caught on a video cell phone shouting, Nipple! Nipple! There's a fucking nipple in the audience! The African-American patrons were upset by... Uh, Chai, what? Chai, it wasn't nipple. That's not the N-word. He shouted nipple. <laughs> Are you sure? That's a bad word? I've heard that on every rap album ever produced since 1994. Nipple? Really? <laughs> oh, well. What do I know? I'm just a stupid cracker. You can still say cracker, right? Yes, Chai, you can still say cracker. Oh, good. Jew hater Mel Gibson has offered support to Richards, saying that nipples are no good anyway. Nipples have started every war in the world. F*** nipples. Danny DeVito showed up drunk at 11 a.m. on The View Wednesday after an all-night bender with George Clooney. And amazingly, no one cares. Danny DeVito is not an alcoholic, co-host Rosie O'Donnell said Thursday. He's just a guy who had too many with his friend. You know... That's what I said last week! I'm sorry, thanks, and this is... Nibis Shelby Show. Chai, Chai, you're drunk. Were you out with Paris Hilton all night again? Yeah, you got a problem with that town? Chai, Chai, you're an alcoholic, okay? You need help. So there you go, Tom. Danny is a jolly guy who just said too many with his friend, and I'm an alcoholic. Is that fair? Is it, Tom? Is it? Danny DeVito gets away with everything. Damn midget. Eva Longoria is engaged to basketball player Tony Parker. The hot wetback from Desperate Housewives is said to be... Guys, what? Guys can't say that. What? Wetback? Yeah. How about Beaner? No. Greaser? No, he can't say that. Taco Eater? No, Ty, you can't say that. But I could say cracker. Yes, Ty, you can still say cracker. Oh, good. As long as I can say cracker, saltine motherfucker. <laughs> Lindsay Lohan has entered into Alcoholics Anonymous. Part of the 12-step program is number seven. Make a list of all persons you have harmed and become willing to make amends to them all. In that case, Lindsay, I want my ten bucks back from Harvey fully loaded. Either that or send me a video of you jumping up and down. In that Hermione outfit, or any kind of schoolgirl outfit is fine. Step seven, Lindsay. Step seven. And in that guy's dead news, famed film director Robert Oldman is dead. Hey, at least he got to feel up Lindsay Lohan before he died. Hey, Knicks fan, what time is it? Hey, this is Knicks fan here watching Showbiz Newsy News, and it's this week in pictures. Hit it, Ty. No, Nicole, you can't have any. You know you'll just throw it up later, and that's just a good waste of fries. Kylie Minogue shows off her new perfume. It's for women who smell really, really bad. Quick, think of a shape. Any shape at all. Let me guess. Circle, right? <laughs> Lindsay Lohan steps out of an especially aggressive S&M session. Still holding the handcuffs? and sporting a bloody nose. Prince Amir tries to stare at Angelina Jolie's chest by trying the old, quick, it's a pink elephant right over there, trick. Based on this photographic evidence, Donkey Kong was later charged and convicted of sexual assault. There's a lesson here, kids. 
Watch out who your MySpace friends are. You just never know. <laughs> Poor Donkey Kong. I never saw what happened to him. <laughs> What's Mario gonna think? <laughs> I'm Ty Paddington, and that was Showbiz Newsy News. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go panty shopping with Britney Spears.